I got a call from a guy named Father Bud Kaiser. So he's got you. He's got you. Did you talk to him? I said, a little bit. And he, he never said it in so many words, but you kind of knew if you didn't, you were going to hell. When Father Elwood Kaiser finishes saying mass each morning, he takes off his collar and goes to work as a movie maker and persuader. Huge big man, big white hair, handsome, huge and lovely. In an industry where many producers only enjoy success for a short time, he created television and film for four decades. I never saw the priest when he was producing. He was as tough or even tougher than any Hollywood producer. <laughs> In a town that celebrates glitz, he created an award that convinced Hollywood to celebrate the noble. You know, the normal parish priest, he has his parishioners. Well, my parishioners are the people in show business. The thing that was special about Father Bud Kaiser, he didn't judge you, whether we were religious or Jewish or Catholic or Protestant or whatever, we were all accepted. Father Elwood Kaiser lived his life as a man of faith, yet he was not spared from moments of doubt and confusion. Maybe we reassess our vocational choice, and we meet people, and that's what happened to Father Bud. He fell in love with a nun. He was a priest, but he wasn't. He was a producer, but he wasn't. He was all of those things, and not a single one of them 